Hey, what's happening, folks? Back here with another video, and today I'm going to be opening some prison football. Finally have some of this stuff. I didn't get this from the store. I'm still basically in trading card jail uh, since the whole Kobe thing here. But hopefully that ends soon because can't wait to go out there and, you know, uh, go hunting for sports cards and see what the stores have and all the stuff. I know a lot of people love watching that kind of stuff and see what other stores have. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I got them for my West Coast Connection, so shout out to them. Uh, and as you guys can see, it's in pretty rough shape, but it's nothing we can do. I mean, this is pretty much the stuff gets, you know, delivered in the mail, and um, hopefully the cards are okay. So I know the mail's been crazy lately. Alright, so before I go ahead and open this up, I do want to address a couple things uh, regarding the video uh, with Ultimate Collectibles. I know there's, you know, there's a number of people that found it pretty, I guess... Uh, you know offensive or you know like it this was pretty much um, you know is it a joke or you know the prices are pretty expensive why are you showing some support to this store you know it, it's something folks that uh, this store you know the owners have been really nice to me and they've done a lot of favors to me in the past not gonna lie you know it's it's not involving just carts you know it's it's uh, other stuff and you know, I remember one time I left my car keys inside you know they went ahead and immediately helped me with that uh, it was like freezing cold outside and pretty much I got you know locked locked out of my car I mean there's been all kinds of favors they've done in the past and when you go ahead and do something like this you know share some of their stuff what they have in store you know it never hurts you know I, I wasn't forcing anybody to go in the store and, and, and go check it out you know for those who are uh, local it is something that is by choice. If people want to go, they want to go. And if you don't support that, that's fine. You know, I, I, I understand. You know, I'm not going to get mad or anything. You know, it, it's fine with me. If people don't support that, you know, we just simply move on. You know, of course, you know, it's, it's 2020 was a crazy year when, you know, we just couldn't find any carts, you know, and I feel like it was right after prison basketball when, you know, shit hit the fan and prices started going up. Everything just started climbing up. And I keep going to store and store. I couldn't find anything, you know, Target, Walmart. I, I understand. I understand, you know, the frustration, you know, why hobby stores have this stuff like, I don't know, three, four times more of the price than what retail is. Uh, it's something that I, I can't really help. You know, it's not my business. It's not my store. Uh, they're not my customers. I can't say, hey, you know what? I can't tell them, you know what? Uh, you should not buy anything from them, you know, because I know that they're buying the product from customers. You know, uh, honestly, they're way too busy to go out to, to uh, Target or Walmart and clean out the shelves. I can tell you that, you know, I how many times I actually ask them if they can get some of the product for me in the past, you know, maybe if they see it in the store or whatever, zero. I mean, it's just they're just way too busy with what they do. It, it's a pretty much a mom and pop shop. You know, I've seen worse. I've seen stores that are worse than that, even selling hobby like three times more the price. And I'm not gonna name those stores. You know, I'm not. I'm not the type of guy who's gonna go in and, you know, just just bring a store down, just you know, talk shit behind, uh, behind them and say, yeah, you know, this store or that and that. I'm not gonna do that. I just did them a favor. That's all. You know, so we just move on. Anyway, that's not you know what this video is about so I'm just gonna go out and open this and see what I get so hopefully like I said the cards are okay um, <laughs> looks really rough so when I got this it was a little bit worse but Alright, so this is pretty much the pack. I'm surprised they didn't put them in, um... It's a little, um... It's like those, you know, like a... Kind of like a little poker, when you buy poker cards or whatever. A little cardboard inside. So... Alright, let's see what I get from here. Honestly... I don't think I've ever had any great luck with Prism, except... I'm... And I'm... I know I keep saying this, I'm pretty positive I pulled Mahomes um, back in 2017 
and I mean I just kept opening packs and packs and packs off camera so I had I remember I had a lot of rookies I eventually you know sold them all and got rid of them so I don't know I don't know what happened but after that I didn't buy a lot of prism I just got some of them as a gift or you know just bought a few packs and that's it nothing really crazy Tyler Boyd so the cards are are in good shape I mean this one seems to be a little I don't know Travis Kelsey Harrison Smith Greg Sterling Got a green one coming up. Baker May Mayfield. All right, it's not a rookie. Then we got the blue ones. I think you get like one uh, or three. Is it three? Icy blue ones or whatever. Dude Westbrook. Kenny Stills. And the last blue one is a J.K. Dobbins rookie. Okay, so I got a rookie. Let's see what else I got in here. Miles Garrett, stop bubble insert, and a James Morgan rookie. So that's pretty much it. <laughs> um, I mean it's not bad. I guess I did get a decent, you know, looking card here. I love the color, that's one thing for sure, so I'm not going to complain about that. It is a little bit off-centered, but I wish I would have done better. Uh, we'll see. I do have a couple more, so we'll see on that. Um, other than that, um, yeah, man, I can't wait to go out and uh, just, you know, go out car hunting again. Uh, hopefully this weekend, you know, this, they're supposed to end this this whole uh, restriction so we'll see on that I'll keep you guys pulse it and the only way you guys will know is either for those who are following Instagram or if I drop the video so all right keep you guys pulse it thanks for watching guys